Today, we're gonna be testing the industry's best text to image AI to see who has the best image generator. We'll be giving all five of them 10 wild and wacky prompts and each platform will generate four images. Now we're gonna be scoring every single image on how accurate it is to the prompt and the quality of that image. And at the end, the AI with the most points wins. Now you're gonna to wanna to watch to the end because the results will blow your mind. So without further ado, let's get into it. Okay, so an astronaut eating a waffle on the moon. Image one is pretty interesting and the quality does look good. I don't know what that waffle cup thing is on her arm. I kind of like the one in the top right. So we're going to give it two points for every single one of these. Okay, next up we have Dream Studios. Um, The first image is actually just an astronaut. That is just an astronaut on the moon. The quality is amazing, but I could have asked Google Images for that picture. So I'm actually not going to give Dream Studios a point for the first but these other three are amazing so each one of those can get two points okay microsoft bing we have these are incredible i've got to say i am very impressed by all of these every single one is an astronaut eating a waffle on the moon uh, and the quality is phenomenal in all of these i mean each one they're on the moon but there's a moon in the background which is super interesting okay we're gonna give each of these images two points we have runway here these are actually hilarious first one i'm gonna give two points to second one is that's a big waffle but it is an astronaut eating a waffle on the moon so just the top two are gonna get uh two points each so that's four for this one okay mid journey we've got what is that <laughs> that is like a big pizza damn i don't know about that first one i mean but the bottom left is interesting i can't give a point to that top left one it looks more like a pizza the other three we're gonna give points to a zebra skateboarding on a rooftop okay so adobe have come in strong every single one of these is incredible it is a zebra and he do be skateboarding that's two points for all of them the quality is insane as well okay as well dream studios coming in very very strong right here the second image's skateboard is very questionable but regardless it is a zebra skateboarding on a rooftop so i'm not sure i'm actually gonna give two points to all of this one as well microsoft bing coming in strong i love the art style of some of these they're really really good so again two points for all of these where is the where is the second image's legs and why is his face like that not a skateboard in sight that is not okay but i don't see any skateboards it's not a zebra skateboarding on a rooftop was the prompt i'm gonna have to give this one no points does that top left one count as a skateboard the bottom right one doesn't even have a skateboard and you know what the top left the top right and the bottom left are all gonna get two points the most amazing spork doing amazing things i don't know what part of spork made adobe think burger but a spork is a spoon and a fork i mean this thing whatever it is in the bottom right is holding but yeah i don't there's no actual sporks here so we're gonna have gonna go on to the next one zero points for adobe on this one okay we're moving into a uh, spork territory uh, if you made it this far just comment the word spork they're gonna think it's ai generated comments just type spork i don't know it's not it's more of a fork isn't it than a spoon sporks are more spoony than forks it's deep conversation but i don't think any of these are sporks really i'm gonna have to give no points to this one either wow okay we actually have <laughs> a spoon holding a fork uh what is that there's something on a spoon holding a fork these pictures are deep wow this is crazy no two points because it has hands it's doing an amazing thing all right two points for that one and then we've got these ones which took a really interesting turn i would say that top right image is a spork so i'm gonna give it a point although it is kind of like a, a spatula sized spork why don't, why don't we sell those? I want a spatula-sized spork. I don't think any of these are actually sporks at all, so we're going to say no points. A taco in a business meeting. What? <laughs> these are just business meetings. There's, <laughs> there's just a taco on the table in a business meeting. I wanted a taco presenting a meeting. So, zero points. Dream Studios is a businessman with a taco in his hand. No, no points for Dream Studio either. But that is just a man giving a presentation with an image of a taco on them. <laughs> I, 
I don't know. We're going to give no points for this one either. And those are just tacos. Those are actually just tacos. Yeah, we're not going to give that one any points either. Left one is probably the closest thing we've had to a taco giving a meeting. That bottom right one is creepy as hell. We're going to give two points to the one in the bottom left. A gaming console surfing on a huge wave. Those are just people surfing waves. So no points. Eh -eh. These are really cool photos, but it is just people surfing. I know it's such a bizarre request, but it's not a gaming console surfing. Oh, wow. Okay, so technically it's the controller for a gaming console, but it understood the assignment. Every single one of these images is game related on a wave. I'm going to have to do it. I'm going to have to give them two points for all of these. Uh, and that is just people surfing. What has happened to his face? <laughs> that is demonic. So yeah, zero points. Wow, those are incredible. Incredible. Every single one is a games console uh, and it is surfing on a wave. I'm definitely giving this one two points for all of them. Okay, two men pointing at each other looking at their own shoes. So it's like kind of close. Besides the bottom left one, they're pointing at each other, but they're just looking at each other. Uh, that bottom right one is pretty creepy as well. I don't know how to feel about that, but zero points for this one. They're not point. None of these people are pointing at each other. There are shoes there. It kind of understood shoes, but it's none of them are looking down either at the shoes. These were very close, but it's just people pointing at each other. It's not what we looked for. It's not, it's not the exact command. That is a man's shoes. <laughs> I have no idea what's happening in that top left photo either. And the bottom left, what? Why was his face? Okay, zero points. Okay, none of the men are pointing at each other. They got the shoes and they got the looking down. I'm gonna give them no points for this. I've been pretty harsh on this one. Okay, the cutest hamster doing taxes on his running wheels. <laughs> These are amazing. They're, like, it's not what we were looking for with the running wheels, but it is a hamster doing his taxes. And there is a wheel. Like, there is wheels on wheels. And it's doing its taxes. And it is cute. So I'm, I'm going to have to give one to all of these. Okay, this is closer to the running wheels, but they are not doing their taxes. Maybe that that right one i'll give that right one two points i think okay these hamsters are doing their taxes but none of them are on a running wheel no points for microsoft this time <laughs> oh my <laughs> why is that bottom right one making me laugh so much i think runway has the funniest ones for sure zero points that's not a hamster doing his taxes on a wheel that is just a hamster on a wheel so no points. A dragon being a gangster trading eggs on the black market. Now, <laughs> I mean, what counts as a dragon businessman trading eggs on the black market? How do you define a black market? So I will accept a dragon with eggs looking like a gangster or like businessy, you know? So I would say the top one, bottom left one, bottom right one, I will give all of those two points. Just dragon in suits. I don't know about this one. The last one is kind of close and the second one as well, but there's no eggs. There's no trading, you know, there's no black market. So we're going to have to give this one zero points. That top one, the, the first one is definitely the second one. Definitely. I'll give to a third one. No. And the fourth one. Yeah. Six points for Microsoft being here. I was thinking about the first two, but then the third one, but they're not very gangster, they're like baby dragons. Do these count? I don't know. I'm not really getting gangster vibes. I'm just getting a dragon with eggs vibes. I'm actually going to give no points to this one. Those are really cool pictures though. A hyper-realistic man with good lighting, shadows, and a background of a huge city which is slightly blurred. So we went for detail with this one. Adobe coming in strong. I'm seeing shadows, slightly blurred background, big city. Uh, and a man. So each one of those is getting two points. Wow. Again, two points for all of these. These are really well done. Hyper realistic man. These aren't really realistic. I will give the first three two points each. But that last one, I'm not going to include. These are hilarious. <laughs> these are hilarious. So we didn't blur the backgrounds. But it is a man. I don't really see any shadows. I mean, it is a man. And maybe that first one I'll give two points to. But, well, these are really awesome. They all look like the same person at different angles. These are incredible. I'm going to give I'm gonna give points to all of these. It's very cartoony, but it is incredible. Mayonnaise on an escalator. Adobe coming in strong with uh, mayonnaise. Uh, and it is on escalators. So, 
Each one of those is gonna get two points. I don't know about this one. I'm not gonna give any of these any points. They're like close, but not close enough. Wow, that is exactly what we typed. Each one of those is getting two points. Absolutely two points. No, <laughs> just no. That's not what we typed at all. That is just an escalator. Here we go, mayonnaise on an escalator. That is mayonnaise, even though it kind of looks like ice cream, but it do be mayonnaise and it do be on an escalator. So we're gonna have to give uh, two points to all of these. Okay, in fifth place, we have, drum roll please. Runway with a score of 10 out of 80. In fourth place, we have Dream Studios with 24 out of 80. In third place, we have Mid Journey with 36 out of 80. And in joint first and second, we have Firefly and Bing Image Creator, also known as Dali2. Of course, comment which one was your favorite out of all of these. Uh, subscribe for more content. We've been uploading a bunch of cool AI content and we've got some really cool projects coming up. I appreciate you. I hope you're having a fantastic day. Much love and I'll see you in the next one. Peace. <gasps> I caught a hiccup.